Building International Bridges My grandfather participated in people-to-people -people programs which took him to difficult places for us to visit today. Today we can use Skype and the internet to connect. However, there are some differences that we need to train our young people in what to do. Building International Bridges brings free ebooks. We find pen pals. We help students become English teachers and we give cross-cultural uh, lessons. If you've got ebooks, you have something to give to people who can't get on the internet. We show people how to use Skype. If you wish to support international education, we have the QBE, Qualified by Experience Education Fund. It's a school in England and France. And we invite you to support it. They're in particular need of about $50,000 from 5,000 people. So that would be $10 each. So I hope that you can participate. Donations are tax deductible for U.S. audiences. They teach the global skills of communication, curiosity, collaboration, accessing, and analyzing information, adaptability, and initiative. We also have the Gordon Dyke Education Fund. This is organized through New Dawn Association. New Dawn is located in Kenya. They don't have a pass-through organization that can give tax deductions, so anyone in the United States that wishes to support their work, part of their work is helping orphans, then when they come to the ninth or tenth grades, their school fees are needed, so for forty dollars a month you can help cover their school fees. We remove obstacles. That's building international bridges. We don't duplicate what other people are doing. Here's an example of some of the work that we bring. We find educational videos. We download them using Zamzar and we bring lectures, talks, that will bring help to other people. Mentors on Video is of particular interest. We hope that you will sign up to become a mentor on video so that students around the world can hear your wisdom. We are ready for your suggestions. Building International Bridges.